Eurobass are famously known for throwing the best parties, so you can expect a Yoruba traditional wedding ceremony to be filled with life, color, and culture. Let's get into it. There are two aspects of a Yoruba traditional wedding, traditionally known as Igbeya Wui Bile, the introduction, and the wedding proper. The introduction ceremony is an informal affair where the groom's family introduces themselves to the bride's family to make their intentions known of asking for their daughter's hand in marriage to their son through the help of an intermediary referred to as standing policeman, or Lokbai Duru. The ceremony takes place in the bride's house and they are responsible for all preparations and costs. During this event, both families will agree on the traditional wedding date and the bride's family will represent the engagement list known as Eri Yawu to the groom's family. The Eri Yawu is a traditional Yoruba custom where the groom gifts the bride's family certain items for raising a fine daughter. The list contains all that they expect to receive from the groom's family to accept the union. Most Eri Yawu lists in Yoruba traditional weddings usually contain items like the bride price, kola nut, fruit baskets, engagement rings, and others. After the introduction ceremony is concluded, the traditional wedding can now take place. The Yoruba traditional wedding ceremony is usually moderated by two MCs known as Alaga. They are usually older women from both families, but nowadays people tend to just hire a professional Alaga. These women add spice to Yoruba events, or Yoruba weddings with their jokes and songs and ensure that the ceremony is fun and lively. The ceremony starts once the groom's family arrives and is seated. The groom then dances in with his friends and they prostrate in greeting to the bride's family. This method of greeting is called idobale in Yoruba and the guys must lay down flat completely to be accepted. This humble greeting is done to show that the groom has respect for the bride's family and that he values their daughter, who he wants to marry. The bride's family then prays for him, and he takes his seat. The bride also dances in with her friends, and greets her family, who prays for her. She kneels before her groom, and the family prays for their union to be blessed. She then removes and rewears his filler on his head, to show she accepts his marriage proposal. At this point, the Allah Gaiju Ujuku will ask the bride to select one item out of the Eri Yawu, she will usually pick the Bible or Quran, depending on the family's religion. Inside this book, she'll find an engagement ring and give it to her husband. The groom then wears her the ring. A fun fact, usually during the ceremony, the husband or the groom will be asked to carry his bride. And this is why it's called Igweyawu, which literally means to pick up your bride or to carry your bride. The famous Yoruba party Owambe can now begin.